Hey y'all, welcome back. I uh, got just yesterday my November uh, Black Needle Society subscription box. And so the theme for November is resolution stitching, getting us all ready for that end of the year, beginning of next year stitching. This is their regular subscription box. Uh, which I believe they're still waitlist for, but they seem to get people off the waitlist pretty much uh, every time they ship a box. So well worth getting on the waitlist. These come out every other month, so six times a year, and there's different themes. And the January theme, a little biased, but it's gonna be amazing. So, but I'm very excited to get into this box because if I recall correctly, the designer is Jacob of Modern Folk Embroidery. And it's a bigger piece than normal. Like typically these, the patterns in these boxes are, you know, small, medium-ish. So I'm excited to get into this. Should we, should we just dive in? Let's dive in. Do, do, do. And this box feels bigger than some of their other boxes. I don't know. I mean, just like the actual box itself. Okay, so let's see. There's always a, a little pamphlet that has the photo challenge on the back some featured um, photos from previous photo challenges, a little note from the ladies, and look, the March box is gonna be steampunk stitching. <gasps> Very excited for this one. That's gonna be a cool theme. And then this tells you everything that's in the box, but I only look at that if I need to see, um, if I need a little more clarity on what things are. So let's see, so there's, there's definitely some some packing. Oh my gosh, good looking stuff in here already that I can see. Uh, specialty floss. Always love to see who they have for, ooh, ooh. Oh, it's forbidden fiber, y'all. Oh, and it's a big old hank called River of Life. 46 yards. Look at that. That is just, is that focusing okay? That is just stunning. River of Life, 46 yards. Why do I have a feeling this is how much we're gonna need for whatever that pattern is? It's so pretty. Okay, then this is a New Year Wish. Oh, it looks like a little sparkler. Is that a sparkler? It emits a spray of golden showers. <gasps> so a little sparkler to light on New Year's. Love that. Oh, this is always the needle minder. I love all of their um, branded packaging that they've uh, moved to over the past year or so. I mean, maybe it's been a year since they went to that, but so good. Okay, let's see. Oh, it says New Year, New Start. Won't that be perfect? I'm, I think I may have decided on my New Year, New Start, but we'll have to see what this pattern is. This is great. Metal, it's got a great really strong mag this one's got a really strong magnet oh i love that with the little thread going through the hourglass instead of sand new year new start perfect look at this stitching journal and planner i mean who i'm gonna rip into this y'all i'm ripping in um you guys know you all know that i love uh a stitchy planner uh, but I hadn't decided on what I was going to do. I haven't used my stitchy planner as much this year as I have in the past. So this might be the thing. Oh, that comes all the way off. Oh, look at this. So it's got, oh, stitch all the colors, stitching challenges. It's got like a full month calendar. Look at the cool daily stitch and project progress trackers. <gasps> well, we're not going to talk about new purchases, are we? And then there's weekly. Oh, this is cool. Okay, I'm going to have to really take a good look at this. But this looks really cool. Very fun. This is really pretty. This along with a perpetual calendar for my whips might this might be just because i like that it's a smaller size i've decided i needed a smaller size that's great oh and prod oh some project trackers from s ward designs 
These are great. These are three-year project trackers. I love these. I need to get one in all of my projects. Um, so this will get me a good start. Okay, what's next? Stitching challenge deck. Use these 52 cards to help inspire your stitching throughout the year. Choose a card when you need help choosing your new project or draw one card a week for a fun year long challenge. <gasps> that is really fun. I might have to do one a week. I like that. Ooh. Oh, and look, it's a little, it's a little stitch counter. I mean, I think you can, a lot of people use these for um, their knitting projects too. And you just do, 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 reset. So you can figure out how many rows. That's great. Love that for all those stitching challenges where you count. What else do we got in here? Ooh, oh, they're like little, they're st planner stickers, but look how pretty. They're all, look at the needles and the thimble and scissors, floss on floss drops. Those are so pretty. Those will be perfect for the planner. All right, and here it is, Jacob's chart, the river. The river that flows in you also flows in me. How pretty is that? And then it's river of life. Um, Yeah, yep, gonna do that chart and that floss. I have plenty of fabric. Let's see how big it is. I'm gonna open it up because it doesn't say right on the back. I'm gonna open it up. We're gonna see what the size is. Oh, this is a nice printed chart. Um, 131 by 223, and this is a nice booklet. 131 by 223. So not, like that's a medium. That's a nice medium size sampler. Like that's doable in a year, for sure. I like it. I like that kind of message of unity. I'm really liking that. Okay. Oh my gosh, guys, this was a great box. Look at this. We've got the we've got the chart, a planner with some stickers. I mean, this is all about the planning. I love it. Some cards from project cards from S Word Designs, a year of stitching challenges. We've got a needle minder. The beautiful floss from Forbidden Fiber, a little sparkler to light, and a stitch counter. You're all set. We're all set now for the next year's stitching challenges. I need to, I have been kind of out of the stitching challenge uh, game for a while and just been kind of focusing on my whips, but we'll see. Maybe I'll get back into them uh, next year, but at the very least, this could be a really fun, like, weekly thing. We'll have to bust into those come January. All right. Thanks for opening my box with me and uh, I'll see you next time. Bye.